Hello Space Engineers, Wellington 6012 here, welcome back to close to home, sorry about the loud thrusters, uh, maybe we should sort of slow down a bit, it's good, so you find me in control of the hydrogen fuel tanker, which was nicely parked in the, uh, in the parking spot for, um, the orbital parking spot, so things are good. Now, just as I sort of start, I see over there that it's 53 k's away, which, hmm, I'm sure it was only like 35 or something. Uh, but some observations, because I will not be driving over there, <laughs> I'll be flying over. Uh, yeah, let's just get this hooked up. And um, I'm thinking I need to make a little bit of a, yeah, somewhere we can dock, over there. Uh, make a bit of a scout type ship um, just a real simple drone sort of thing so I'll probably do that up here and attach it to the hydrogen tanker and then take it down with that so we'll just do like atmospheric thrusters and things I'll just connect this up because I'm just not sure what we've actually got on board the thing um, yeah, I, just, I don't know where my connector is. That's the rear connector, I think. Which we probably want to keep... For, well, actually, no, we probably could use the rear connector. It's spinny spinny around. And then we could put the put the other thing on the front. Uh, yeah, so I was just thinking about, like, um, how to put... Uh, how, to, how to get a, a relay antenna, but then I thought, actually... Probably the antenna that's on this would actually do the trick. Does this have any capacity? So, I mean, uh, capacity in regards to batteries and stuff. So they're depleted in 19 hours, and that's with the antenna fully on. And it's not going to be using any power when it's down on the ground as such. Uh, in fact, you could you'd turn that off and then you'd have even less power. Uh, Power stuff. No, it's still 19. Um, hmm. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, oh, we do have a parachute. That's good. Just in case we need it. Uh, and then... Do we have any... Power-making capacity? No, we don't. But, let's say 19 hours. That's quite a while. So, let's just try and dock this thing. I'm assuming there's a connector. Yeah, there is a connector. Oh, we're there. We're there. We're there. We're there. We're there. We're there. Okay, uh, we're all pretty well connected there, so I can just lock that, so that's fine. Uh, I could put the batteries on recharge if I had a recharge option. Do I have a recharge option? I don't see a recharge option. Hmm. Let's put a recharge option on the battery. Battery, battery. Maybe we don't even have batteries as a group. Hmm. What about in here? Battery, 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 battery. Do I not have batteries as a group? Battery. No. Okay. Ooh, how full are they? Are they filling up anyway? Depleted. Stored. Okay, let's give them a recharge. Right. Inventory. Let's have a look. So on the ship we've got all that stuff. Then here we've got all that. So that can go on board. Looks like that can go on board. That can go on board. It's going to be pretty heavy, but I think the thruster will do. And if it doesn't, Mm, then I'll be wrong and we'll have to do this all over again won't that be fun more mining for gold and stuff uh, but yeah that's that's all that sure there was oh no that's, that's that okay so that's pretty much we'll need to cross reference that with whatever we need but that's I mean that's clearly what was required 
Okay. Um, hmm. So. We'll need to make some more power cells. I'll just do that now. Um, and some more motors. Motors. Motors are missing. We needed motors. How many motors do we need? Uh, let's just get out of here. Motors, motors. I'm sure we needed a whole heap of motors. Computers? We need a whole lot of computers. 300 computers. Okay, so we'll do that. 20 detect components. We'll do that. I think everything else is kind of there. Some tube metal grids. Okay, maybe we're at 16 motors. Hmm. Okay, that's not many. Right. Into there. Uh, which one? Uh, Martian Gateway. So we'll do some of them. We'll do a whole lot. Uh, have we got enough stuff? Yeah, we've got heaps of stuff. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, and computers was it? Do a few hundred of those. Right, okay, so that's that. So, yeah, so that's that's where we're at. Uh, that is ready to go down the planet. Check out the, uh, the beta site. We've got most of the stuff there, which we'll take with us. Uh, yeah, and potentially... Oh, look, there's another 100 superconductors there, so I need 2,100. Did I have 2,100? Because there's a thousand... Hmm, okay, we'll try we'll try and remember that. I mean if we make second traps, that's that's fine. If we can get the bulk of it down, nothing like that. Uh yep. So let's make a little bit of a drony thing. So that we can once we get down there we can have a little bit of an explore. So what I was thinking was pretty much Pretty much something like that, but that's that's actually, and we'll build it on the, the ion thing, so that'll be fine. Um, so we'll go like this. So, I mean, things we, we really are just getting sort of to the tail end of this um, scenario now, there's not really a lot to do, so that's quite exciting. Um, what I'm going to do today, as I say, is just go down, build this, go down and explore. And, yeah, and figure out what we need to do and where we need to go. Because I, I can't actually remember what's down there. It's been such a long time since I made the scenario. Uh, we'll put you on there. So that'll be our main sort of thrust. And then we'll put a battery on... So yeah, not massive goals today. Um, so that's that. And then if we put some little ones on and like, I think like this. I quite like this design, like that. Same on the other side. I mean, do we even need four? Yeah, we'll go for four, because that's going to be the equivalent of 1.3 regular ones. And then we can use those. And I think that works nicely. And then our side shift stuff. Like so. Okay. That's good. Um, we'll have the camera. Oh, we need a remote. Uh, and we'll need a, just a little bit of down thrust as well. Yeah, so let's do that. And probably. Uh, no, no, right. I was just thinking about. Oh, here I am. I've actually got a jetpack. <laughs> I've been playing scrapyard and stuff, and I haven't got a jetpack. I've got a jetpack here. I don't need to worry about it. <laughs> Not having a jetpack. Okay, uh, so let's go like that. We'll put a camera on there. Just need to find a camera. Should have done it when I had the remote out. Okay. 
like that. Uh, we need a one of those and a gyro, and I think. I think that's all we sort of need. Can't think of anything else. Gyro. I mean, this is just going to be an investigation type thing. Really straightforward. Yeah, so that's that. Um, and yeah, I'll just load it up on the projector that's up there. But I mean, that's it. That's... That's it. Okay. Uh, or oh, maybe a light. Maybe a light might be useful because it is night time here at the moment. <laughs> Daytime here, night time there, which is really annoying. Uh, yeah, let's put some lights on. So we could put those. We went... Well, actually, I'll tell you what. We'll get rid of you. And we'll just try and do this with a little bit of style. We need to make it red is what we need to do as well. Let's just do that. Okay, so that's all red now. Uh... Let's, let's get it like this. Like so. And then we'll put those in there like that. You may think that they don't actually have a way around but they do as far as I'm concerned they do because there's a little strutty thing that comes out the bottom hmm. okay it's fine and then we can put some lights on here like so this will be able to charge up while it's connected to the to the um, tanker on the way down so That's cool. Okay. Uh, let me just name some stuff. We'll just call this uh, Martian Drone. Disposable Martian Drone. DMD. We'll call it that. And uh, yeah, I'll just uh, load up some of these things. Disposable Martian Drone. And we'll call it 13. Because. 13 they're lucky and this will probably have something go wrong with it uh yeah so let me weld this we'll, uh get the projection done and then we'll uh we'll put it on the ion tug up at the martian and we'll get ready to weld it and then we'll connect and we'll hit down to the surface that's the plan see you soon Pokey pokey, so I think that's everything I need. I might just do some displays. Detect him? No, I don't need that. Yeah, I think that's everything. Let's open that back in there. Yes, okay, so I've got Future Wellington with me. Uh, let's just make sure. Oh, we can press that button there, maybe? Yes. There we go. Right, so I've got the projection on the back. I've already lined it all up, so that's uh, that's on there. And yes, I have future Wellington with me, so we'll be able to do some different camera views. Let's just head over here. Uh, okay, here's a thought. Here is a thought. Oh, we'll need to do it once it's actually turned off, on, once it's printed. The, Things I'm talking about. Let's just spin around because well, this camera is the other way. Okay. Bring this across. Can't see. Oh, no, we're doing stuff. We're doing stuff. Zoom in a little bit. See things. Uh, hmm. Well, the world is a guy, and they're not actually doing anything. Oh, there we go. Maybe. What are we going to do that view? Oh, now we can't see him. Why? What? 
Oh, it's the... What is that? Oh, it's the... It's the, um... It's the antenna. It just looks a little weird from this view. Maybe? Hmm. Oh, well. Let's not think about it. Uh, right, okay, so that's that. Okay, it's all welding up quite nicely. Maybe we just let it do its thing. Do a bit of a barrel roll. Hmm, I still don't understand that view that I'm looking at through the camera. Very strange. Oh, antennas. Um. Whoops. Antennas. Okay, let's go into the gateway. Not control terminal. Production one, two, three, four. Okay, should finish it off. So, yep, eighty two of eighty two. Okay, right, uh, let's go. And go back into that view. Yeah, that was bizarre. That view. I'm not quite sure how that's that's coming about. Hmm. Okay. So let's bring it over here. Uh, we'll just turn some things off. So at the mo Okay, I didn't put a group in for the atmospheric thrusters. I'm sure, I put a group in for those. Hmm. I think I was going to and I got sidetracked. <laughs> Atmospheric. Uh, thrusters. Swore I did them. Hmm. Plainly not, because here we are. Okay, so what we'll do. Oh, never we'll turn them off. That was the whole point of putting the thing in there. Let's turn them off. We don't want them on right now. Uh, yeah. Okay, so that's that. And then if we disconnect, maybe I'll just reposition the camera. Each one that is. It's a bit dark over here. Uh, oh, merge block. Merge block off. Okay, and we go. Turn that projector off. Okay, and there it is. Grab it from here. Do the water lock thing link. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Water lock off. It's ready to lock. Yes. I'll throw this over here somewhere. Done. Okay, that's that. Uh, now we'll go into the gateway again, but this time we want to go into the remote for the... Uh, hmm, for the... 
what is going on there? Oh, because I'm in the wrong gateway. Uh, Martian gateway. Try that. There we go. Uh, there it is. Bulk gas tanker. Control. Uh, where is the other lock? Where's the other lock? Where is the other lock? There it is. Ready to lock. Aha. Okay. Uh, into there. So we do need to... Uh, before we disconnect, we need to put the batteries off recharge. Uh, so they on recharge. What do? So they are now... Fully charged? Maybe they were before. Hmm, not sure. Okay. Right. Uh, need to. Okay, we're in that camera. Thrusters are on. Yeah, we just need to disconnect and. Oh, how about we use this one here? There we go. Right. Yeah, don't know how much of that we're going to see since, um... Uh, since it's kind of quite dark here. Hmm. Anywho, right, so where are we going? We are going... We're going over that way. So we probably want to try and stay out of the gravity. So we'll go over here, and I just need to really keep an eye on all the, um... GPS's because I don't want to go further than 50 kilometers. If I turn you off, that's the back thrust, I think. That way we should keep going forward. Yes, we do. Okay, and that'll if we go into the gravity, that'll keep us up, which is good. Okay, so antennas, let's check those. That one's on, fully extended. That one, turn off. Uh, battery, that can recharge off of there. Fully recharge, 30 minutes. Deplete, okay, so that's absolutely fine. Things are good. Right, okay, so let's, uh, let's get this down to the surface. Uh, which, yeah, is down there. That way. Right, seems the thrust is sufficient to arrest our fall, which is good. Uh, turn the those on, and yeah, we've stopped. That's awesome. Okay, let's go down. Do I have like a down camera in? Did I? No. No, maybe that one? No. No, okay. Uh, that's fine. Let's just, okay, we need to drop down a bit more. 
Yeah, I haven't got a down camera. That's that's a little bit of a problem. We'll just ease our way down. We behind? Yeah, we behind. Okay, we're down in that that hole there. As long as we stay, I mean, look, we're still on the same. We had 92% when we sort of came up. <laughs> when we took, when we, yeah. Uh, what if I use that camera? Yeah, okay, that's, that's kind of a little bit better. And there we go. Research base, bravo. Oh, look, it's even got a beacon or something. So that's good. Yeah, I mean, as long as we drop, don't drop below 75% on the hydrogen, and we haven't even dropped a percent <laughs> since we come down, so we haven't used much to... Oh, really? Oh, wobble, wobble, wobble. Okay, let's, let's spin around. Oh. It's a little bit far away. Oh, there's a ship. There's a ship. Now, I've completely forgotten what this ship looks like. <laughs> I know I built it, but yeah, it's, uh, it's been a while. Okay. So, we are ready to touch down. Um, well, that's all thrust and stuff. Okay, let's... Just try and get some ground that's a little bit more level. Okay, but there's looking pretty good. Let's make sure we're centered, that would help. Okay. Just being very careful not to roll the thing, because that would be a bad day. Okay. And there's a station there. I forgot there was a station there. just do that what happens we're down whoa brakes oh no 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 okay that's not what i wanted to do gyros okay let's just put the parking brake on so we don't roll away this time Right, whoo, okay, that was fine. So now, we can drive. Yay, okay. Let's just, let's just leave that there, shall we? And let's get the, uh, the thingamabob out. So if we went and did, get out of that, get out of that go back into this it will go into the that and we'll go into the remote now I didn't set this I was going to set this up on the way down but it wasn't going to get out of control of the gas tanker so what we need here is DMD 13 so we want the connector last, switch lock, the thrusters on off, the mm, no, we'll just get the gyroscope on. Uh, camera view. Oh, that needs to be earlier, I think. Uh, antenna on off. Battery, I did check that, that was fine. Recharge on off. Lights on off. And camera view. Okay. So left to right, because I haven't bothered setting up any sort of auto timer startup things. So 
So those lights are actually on. Okay, so I think we've got everything here. So I just need to turn the lights. Oh, we can do that with the control of it. So, camera. Lights are on and off. Recharge on and off. Antenna. And thrusters and unlock at the same time. Nice, nice. Woohoo, okay, let's have a little bit of an explore and see what we can see. Why, 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 why? Has that got that name? So this is going to be the. Just and have a look at that oh there's a sign there there is a sign okay we've got super side thrust i've actually not flown this before i probably should have tried it on earth that would have made sense but never mind okay actually now we're pretty good it's pretty good I can do lots so yeah that's fine uh right scenario guide for the final part of your journey a logistical challenge repair and refuel the alien vessel once complete, the system, the ship will do an automated full system startup. Then you will be able to remotely pilot it back to your base on Earth, where you can use it to travel toward the alien planet. Ah, okay. Right. Fantastic. Uh, can we... I'm fairly confident that will be on trade mode. So power is possibly a thing that we'll need to do. Uh, no, no, it's not. I can tell you why. That is. Oh, can we get inside? Because. Um. You know what? These towers are going to be really annoying for flying things. I'm going to crash into those. Let's <laughs> get to see it now. Okay, so. Oh, hey, hang on. I'll be able to connect into. I'll be able to connect into these with the um I didn't plan that but with that maybe I did plan it um yeah I'll be able to plug into into the side with that thing oh that'll be good um I guess I did put that on there with the intention of it being uh, multi-purpose can we fit inside there Ooh. small enough to get in there uh yeah okay but there was a hanger down here okay so we can get in here though oh but are we going to be able to get in with the welder ship oh this is a bit spooky hmm going um can i get down the front there no no okay so we've got to repair the we've got to repair the uh reactor and then we have to you know what i don't think this is going to be super difficult I think we won't do it right now but I suspect that okay I've built this in such a way that I can access everything that I need to weld <laughs> go me because um, there's the jump drives there's the laser and so everything I can access from out here that was very smart of me Okay, so that's 
that's good. Um, yeah, okay. Well, I don't think I really want to do that this episode. What we could do is try and just connect that up. Um, and then I might do the edit. I'm not sure if we've got a full episode yet, but um, yeah, I'll connect this up and we'll see what happens with these. So they're all on stop pile. I wonder if they're full or not. Hmm. Okay, let's let's connect this up. So first of all, we will need to. Oh, I can't find it. Cool. Let's go and dock this, and then we'll try and actually. No, I tell you what. What we'll do is we'll turn those lights off because those are annoying. Uh, what we'll do is we will maybe just park this over here. So we've got 45 minutes, so that's plenty of time. Uh, and try and connect this in here and I could probably connect this on the other side of the ship because then that would leave the back open to use the welder ship okay I'm just thinking out loud here uh, so let's get out of that let's get out of that and out of that and go into that go into the bulk carrier control that that camera there and we want to go probably into here. Yes. Uh, right. Let's go for a drive. Yeah, I didn't do any wheel settings on this, I don't think. Which to me seems like a mistake. Let's try that. Wheels, propulsion, brake, air shock. Hmm. No, that's looking actually pretty good. Maybe strength just needs to go up a bit. Should be fine. Maybe we're just going slow because we're going slow. Okay, let's take the long way around. I don't think we'll fly over, we'll just drive. And. Yeah. So. Yeah, I think we'll just plug this in and. Oh, hang on. Thought I was getting a little bit close there with the new thing. What if I went for that one there? Okay, that gives me a better idea of where we're at. Uh, yeah, so we're quite far from the gateway up there, but we're only 30 k's from the pipeline. Yeah, let's just keep swinging around. Um, yeah, so we'll dock this up and then I will call it there I think and if it's a short episode it's a short episode uh, it's just oh what are those wheels doing there in my camera view where's the thing oh there it is I see it I see it I see it oh no that's oh there it is there it is there it is okay we might need to go to over here ooh a different impression. Okay. I think that's looking pretty good. I am still going forward and I have my brakes on. I am still going forward and I have my brakes on. <laughs> I am still going forward and I have my brakes on. We've stopped. Uh, let's try and get into a different camera. So the disposable on there, terminal, camera, view. Okay, well, that's not damaged, so that's okay. Uh, right, which, what do these do? Hmm. Okay, what does that one do? It's annoying, it needs to go up a little bit. Um, if I take the brake off, can I back away? Yeah, I 
second. Okay, it's staying there this time. That's good. Right, why aren't these um, hinges working? Are they... Uh, hang on. What does that actually do? Hinge lock on, off. Okay, because the hinges are probably actually off. So we'll do that. So the hinge lock is that. And then the hinges, they are... Oh, they are turned on. What? Why aren't they working then? No velocity. Okay, <laughs> let's try that now. Uh, so, do that. Up it goes. Oh, stop. Uh, lock, 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 lock. And we're there. We are there. Lock and do that. Ready. Yay! Okay. So then what can we do in here? Um, not a lot. But the remote. Remote control. That's it there. Okay. So we'll be able to take control of that at some point oh we can't now because we're in control of the other thing hmm okay right well let me dock this uh let me dock up the thing and then uh, then we'll call it a day right so uh i just copied from the uh guide on steam the that one there and i'll tell you what we can actually just put that next i don't think that's anywhere else no Let's just get things correct. Seven. Oh, hang on. Clearly, I didn't like do that off this thing quite last time. Okay, so uh, that one we can actually say is completed. 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 Yes. And yeah, so this is all that's left is repair the alien vessel, remotely pilot it back to Earth and board the vessel and pilot it to reach the alien jump point so yeah i can't put that in green hmm never mind uh yep yeah, but um i think that's that's only going to be going to fit into one more episode i i don't unless something goes catastrophically wrong uh i hope it doesn't knock on wood uh then yeah i think we've only got one episode to go because uh, even though there's, you know, sort of a bit to do, it's, um, the prep work has been done. So, yeah, I did get the impression this was going to happen. Uh, I mean, all this stuff, I'll need to check what's actually in the container that's on the gas tanker. But I'm pretty sure most of this is on here. Maybe small steel tubes, did I forget those? I might have forgotten those. Construction components, may have forgotten those uh but all the metal grids grid, all the big stuff all the stuff that is um a problem to manufacture i'm pretty sure is already there so anything that's missing i think we'll be able to actually just produce over at the pipeline at that facility um put it on the welder and then send the welder over to the uh to the ship to the alien ship and yeah so that's all for next time so uh camera's over here somewhere stand by uh, there it is there so um yeah that's that's it for today uh, uh i don't think it was a major step but it was also a massive step forward um because yeah we have ticked off objective seven we've only got number eight to go we have all the resources to do that. That's what we're going to get up to next time. So hopefully you can join me again next time. And until next time, as always, stay safe everybody and have a good one.